What's up, YouTube? Tops 85401 here. I got a stack of cards here I'm going to show off that I could never afford today. Glad I bought them when I did. I think a lot of us feel the same way. But here we go. And these are all blue chip rookies. So I got a 1975 Tops Mini, George Brett, and an excellent near mint six, or what do they call it? Excellent mint six, excuse me. Couldn't afford that card now. Guys, this hobby's nuts. This hobby's nuts. Here's another card I couldn't afford. 1980 Tops, Ricky Henderson, and a PSA eight. Just no way I could afford that card now. I actually remember picking this card up at the LCS. I, I, I bought it the same day they bought it off of a collector. But what that card's selling for, no way could I afford it. This card, never. I could. I, there's no way I could afford this card. A PSA 8 Bowman Tiffany, Ken Griffey Jr. rookie card. I believe these things are selling for about 800 bucks now. And a PSA 8. No way I could afford this card. But I have it. I'm thankful I bought these cards when I did because I'm telling you, I could never afford them. Here's another uh, Griffey Tiffany rookie card. PSA 9 Tops Traded Tiffany. Ken Griffey Jr. rookie card. It's a thousand dollar card now, man. There's no way, no way. No way I could afford this card. And I don't think these cards are done going up in value either, guys. So, we'll, we'll but we'll see what happens. But this, this is a beautiful card. I love it. I couldn't afford it now if I if I wanted to pick one up. This card, 1969, tops Reggie Jackson and a near mint seven. Boy, you talk about a card. There's no way I could afford. Not this one. No way. Not anymore. But it's in my collection. <laughs> and this card, I went on. I was on eBay last night. I was looking at sold completed listings. And I, my jaw dropped to the floor when I saw what this card is selling for. PSA seven near mint. And I mean, guys, I'm not showing PSA tens here either. That's part of this video. These are not PSA tens. This is a PSA seven near mint. Derek Jeter SP rookie. Things selling for a thousand bucks now. And I wouldn't be surprised if it goes higher because all the eights and nines are dried up. They're not affordable for a lot of people. I mean, a thousand bucks, I guess some people are saying, yeah, you know what? That, that card's tough. I'll, I'll, I'll pay a grand for it. But man, here's just uh, five, no, six blue chip rookies and PSA holders that if I were to try to collect them now, no way, no way, no way, no way. And I know we're all, we all kind of feel the same way. So as a hobbyist, I just have to say I'm grateful for what I have. And I'm grateful for what I've got. And boy, if I would have known now what I knew back even a year ago, <laughs> my collection would look a whole lot different. So thanks so much for tuning in. And as always, until next time. Happy collecting!